guys. Apparently, I couldn't waste 20 bucks on gas. Figure that out. Uh, but we got gas. That's what matters. Yay. So now we get to go. We get to go and play because we're... We have a full tank of gas. Which is always nice. You know what I mean? It's just nice. Oh, look at this. Cool. Hola. There we go. That's a little better. It was just a teensy, wincy, bitty windy. Just a little bit, you know? Just a little bit. Incy wincy bit, like that much. That's not true, it's actually a little bit more windier than... It's not heavy wind, but it's enough. Ah, going for a ride. Ah, sexy, sexy ride. Whoa. I hate manholes. Like, why can't they make manholes level? Seriously, guys. Like, can you answer that? Oh, wait, damn it. God. You know what I mean? Like, it's a freaking road for Christ's sake. Make those manholes, you know, like, nice and level and flush with the road. And that would be, like, so cool. But no. Just in case you guys are wondering, if there is any wind noise, I'm going to try and edit it out. Um, for some, I'm just trying to adjust my helmet because there's quite a bit of wind noise that gets through. Uh, for some odd reason. Oh. I think it's the way I put the visor on, to be honest with you guys. It's my fault. My fault. No one else's. Ah, Alright. So now we're stopped. We are stopped. No, we're not. What a beautiful afternoon to ride. And let me tell you, I absolutely had a crummy day today. Wasn't the greatest day I know. Uh, so yeah. With it not being the greatest day, I could not wait to come out for a ride. And I love riding. I really do. Today I have no idea where I'm gonna take you. Where am I gonna take you? Oh yeah, wait. I never know, okay? I never know. It's like from here on in, just so you know. I will almost never know where I'm going to take you. Because basically what I do is I get on my bike. And I don't like to think about where I'm going. I just like to explore. I'm smelling horse manure. Seriously, who the heck has a horse here? Holy. Maybe that's just fertilizer. I'm such a dummy. That's just fertilizer more than likely for somebody's lawn or something. Or their garden. But I'm still smelling it like... Holy Moses, I feel like I'm on a farm right now. I should be like, giddy up. Yeah, giddy up. Woohoo. Gosh, I really enjoy this. You know, I don't know what it is about riding, guys, but I mean, I'm still new to this. and But every chance I get, it's like, I just want to ride. There's just something so fun about riding, and it's just so peaceful and awesome and oh it's I don't know I don't care what bad day you had your day is gonna get a lot better the second you actually go for a ride oh I'm liking this I'm liking this. I'm definitely going to be coming back on this road. Are you kidding me? Oh, seriously cool, guys. Look at this. I just missed the train track. <laughs> it would have so sucked having to wait for the train. 
I, I think I can officially say I have never been on this road. You become very, very uh, much of an explorer when you have a bike. <laughs> it's like I feel like I'm going on a new adventures every damn time I out. But, you know, I can be out riding my bike for an hour and I discover my city a thousand times over. Like, I, I've been living in this city for quite a while and... I mean, granted, you don't always have an excuse to just go from, you know, whatever. But, you know, this is cool. This is way too much fun. <laughs> this is a really neat area. I gotta look at the video and make sure like I know how to get back here. Because now I just took a bunch of lefts and right and I honestly don't know how I got here. In fact, like not only do I not know how to how I got here, I actually don't have a the slightest clue where this is going. Wow. This is cool. Why you go so s actually you're going over the speed limit? <laughs> I underestimated this bike. I mean, seriously, I actually think I have really underestimated this bike. It's maybe a 300, but she's a feisty little 300. I mean, it's definitely faster than most cars. And I'm not looking for speed to start with. I don't know if I, you know, I mean, it's never been about speed or power or blah, blah, blah. For me, it's been about the pleasure of being able to go wherever in the world I want to go um, in the world wherever I want to go like you know for my little explorations and yeah for sure this bike is gonna not have a problem taking me into all those wonderful little adventures I want to have and for a new rider I mean this bike is stupid you can throw this bike around anywhere you want so you know what I love this bike let it go on the record. Mr. K said, I love this bike. This one. This one. And that minion. We love the minions too. Let me tell you guys, I mean, for little 300, I mean, this little thing is actually doing better than most. Actually, a I've driven a lot of cars that were a lot less, uh, that were a lot harder to handle, first of all, and second of all, a heck of a lot less fun, and third of all, this just seems to have a hell of a lot of power even though it's a 300. Um, yeah, I love this bike. I absolutely love this bike. Oh my god. I mean, today was the first time I actually had a chance to just really try her out and give her a little push. I've been really scared on, uh, you know, not to push the bike too much and, you know, I didn't know what the limitations of the bike would be. Uh, I mean, you hear about, like, you know, it's a small engine, 300cc's, blah, 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 this, that, the other thing. Man, guys, let me tell you, this may be a 300cc, and if that doesn't, if you don't know what cc means, screw it, okay? This little bike, Kawasaki Ninja 300 2015 is an awesome, 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 awesome bike. Like... She's got enough pickup, guys. For the city especially, I mean, this is stupid. She can pick up a lot of speed very quick. You know, I mean, she has, what, 13,000 RPM before you hit your red line, so... I mean, let's be honest, that's... You have a lot of room to maneuver, that's for sure. 
I love this bike. Like, you know, I wasn't sure. I, I was not sure when I first, you know, I started doing research on bikes and, you know, should I, get, should I get this? Should I get that? What should I do? Is, uh, you know, like you hear people talking about like the 300cc being the smaller option. Obviously, there's a 125 and so forth and so on or 250s. But I'm telling you guys, like this bike literally just, I mean, if you need more than this, um, I don't know what you could possibly need it for. I know I, I, yeah, I don't know what you could need it for. You know what I mean? So just in case you're wondering, I know what I did wrong. I left it in second gear. <laughs> Uh, noob. See, if my wife sees this, she's gonna be like, See, you do that stuff too. And I'm gonna be like, Ah, oh, crap. I mean, it's. You're, yeah. Yes, I stalled my bike because I was in the wrong gear. Okay? So there, I said it. I'm man enough to admit it. So, that's what happened. Too bad for me. Oh well. Maybe I won't stall it next time. Forever. So yeah. Construction. Alright guys. I hope you enjoyed this. Um, like. Subscribe. Hate. Comment. I don't know. Any of the above. Love you guys. See ya.